Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to today's Black Ops Cold War video, guys. Today, I'm going to be sharing with you the best League Play classes you can create right now. And this is considering all of the, like, the rules that we currently have. So I haven't, as you can tell, or you'll be able to tell here in a second, I haven't actually played League Play yet, but I, yesterday, I wasn't able to play, so I just watched a ton of streamers play it. And based off of that, and based off of the fact that we don't have GAs like we were promised, besides the fact of that, I have the best classes for you. Let's hop into it right now. So I'm going to share with you all 10 of my classes. Now, these classes, it's basically just one, two, three, four-ish classes, and then copied and slightly altered. So there's not a lot going on here, so this may seem overwhelming, but just take it easy. We're going to be doing a lot of copy-pasting. So let's go ahead and hop into our AK-74U class. We are going to be rocking the standard load loadout muzzle break, and then we're running the Task Force Barrel just because it's not banned, and everyone else is going to be using it, so we are too. Then the obvious speed grip. The elastic grip and then the skeletal stock the amadis i mean i don't really know if this is the best loadout I mean, how often are you actually going to use it but i have the muzzle brake i have the task force again uh, i have the steady aim laser because i don't like to use the sight if you want to use the sight you can use the sight in place of the steady aim laser uh, and then i have the fast mag on since there's no downside to the fast mag and then also the elastic wrap and then i love running sun grenade over flash simtex trophy system and then i have perk greed on because once again perk greed's not banned so if it's not banned, we might as well just use all six attachments. And then if you go to the very next class, you'll see what I'm saying. I literally copy pasted it. I just switched. So this one has flag jacket and an engineer. This one has flag jacket and tactical mass for if you don't think you need engineer. Now we're going to go down to the second class or, you know, the next class, which this is going to be like a search and destroy class. If the enemy team is running thermal snipers or snipers at all, really, this is my cold butter class. So once again, it's just a copy paste. And then except for gun ho, just because you don't really need gun ho. But since, you know, like I said, since we can run per grade, you might as well run gung-ho. We're we'll going to be running cold-blooded there with the smoke grenade. Since, once again, smoke grenades are GA'd, but they're not banned in league play, we're going to be running that. And thermals are also not banned, even though I'm pretty sure they're GA'd. So that's why we have cold-blooded on, so you can throw smokes. And then lastly, for the ak 74 use, we have the loser mode class because, once again, overkill is not banned, even though it is GA'd. So we just copy-pasted that ak 74 u We put on the Tundra, which is just your standard Tundra that... You know all the snipers i see anyway use i'm not sure if this is how the pros run it but we have the tiger team tiger team seven round mag el elastic and raider pad basically the bottom handle and the bottom stock are what you're going to be using like 100 percent of the time on basically every gun if you can and then i run flag jacket i like to have gun co so i can switch back and forth and then your standard stun simtex combination next let's hop into the xm4s so in the m4s we have the exact same scenario as the ak where we have all the same attack or same perks just you know flag jack and engineer this one has flag task and then this one has cold butter with the smoke grenade but i'll just go ahead and the diamante is the same i'll just go ahead and share with you my xm4 setup so we have the microflex led we have the muzzle break 556 which i'm not sure if some people are using the infantry compensator or not in that place i feel like with the m4 though like you don't want to have any negative recoil because it already recoils a little bit more than the krig does and then here i'm not running the task force i'm actually running running the ranger because if you do get in that close quarter combat you want to have that ranger barrel the 100 percent bullet velocity will help you in close quarters and then here we have the field agent field agent grip and then airborne elastic obviously you can't run a stock when you have the optic on and then so once again you're going to have that copy paste it all the way across all three of these and then finally we'll go over to for the craig so we'll go to the eight stock the gunfighter 8m4 where this one has the same everything except for now we're going to be adding the tiger team spotlight where you could add the steady aim laser if you want to i just like to have the tiger team just because it's pretty busted honestly uh and then we also are running the 40 round mag just because it only has negative 10 percent reload quickness but you you know you have 40 mag or 40 rounds uh and then we're also running the raider pad and then literally the exact same scenario over on the krig six i didn't do a krig six with all these just because the krig six i feel like isn't really going to be used over the xm4 unless you're running gunfighter like if you're running per grade you might as well run the m4 because that's the all-around better gun but the krig 6 is the better like long range gun if you have all eight attachments so here i have the infantry compressor or compensator not compressor infantry compensator uh and then i have the ranger barrel again which uh, i still have to see if i want to do takedown or mill spec i'm not 100 sure and then we have so right now i'm just going to do the ranger just because i know that one works once again the tiger team spotlight because that's broken you definitely want to do tiger team not steady aim laser on the krig six uh because like i said you can reveal easier you're not going to be a lot of close quarter combat with this thing field agent grip 40 round mag again and the airborne and the raider stock 
again and once again stock uh stun grenade simtex and then i just put gearhead on just because you can do quartermaster but there's not gonna be many times where you're gonna be alive for more than 25 seconds to need a new grenade you know what i'm saying because that's all quartermaster does you're not really gonna need that in league play i don't think where gearhead will help you get your trophy systems faster and then finally we just have just the standard sniper all the same attachments from the loser mode sniper class and then i just have the dmi in this class is simply if they actually ever ban overkill now i just have a sniper class made i had a 10 spot i didn't know what else to do with it you should really never run this class though because everyone's gonna be running this loser mode class so you might as well run it yourself which is why i have it on there but this is you know also i mean per greed's on here too but you know what i'm saying this is just if you ever don't want to have an ak on your back for whatever reason now finally the most important part the operator you're going to want to run the optic gaming the chicago optic the optic chicago operator okay it gives you plus 10 percent skill everyone knows that okay don't put the phase one on that gives you minus five percent skill the optic one gives you plus 10 percent you're welcome so those are all my league play classes they're basically the classes i'm running in pubs because league play compared to pubs there are no differences they didn't ban the stuff that they're supposed to ban now i know david vonderhaar was tweeting at some people saying that they want to do changes so we'll see what happens for now as you guys can see i don't have any of my five games if you guys want to watch me do my five placement games you guys can watch me tonight twitch.tv4 slash rooted patootie it's in the description down below 9 p.m eastern time now my friends are saying uh gills is saying that i have to do my five placement games before we can play rank together and scary saying i don't so i might just get the five placement games done right before the stream but then the whole stream we're doing league play so and I also heard that the, um, the way you get ranked out of the placement games is kind of weird. So who knows where I'm going to get ranked. But regardless of where I get ranked, we're going to be grinding league play all night. So come hang out with us. And let's hop into a game right now. We load into a hard point and I got nuked it. I was literally thinking like, do I want to play Nuketown? Do I want to play Express? And I was like, let's just hop into a hard point where things will be different. And then we got Nuketown. So might as well play. I mean, we already used, you know, a big portion of the beginning of this video on the classes. So I just figured let's just do a quick game. Like I'm going to vote for Nuketown, even though I never would otherwise. But I don't want this video to be too terribly long, so we're gonna hop and do a Nuketown game. Also, I've said this before, the reason why I'm not playing League playing these videos is because I have a very short amount of time I can actually record the video, and I don't want to accidentally get a search and destroy since we can't pick. So that's why we're not gonna be doing League play matches in these videos. Now, don't get me wrong, I like the fact that we can't choose what game mode. Like, that's a good League play where you don't get to choose your map, and it's completely random. You don't get to choose your game mode. Now, unfortunately, Call of Duty is not like other games where there's only one game mode. So it is like different, like, you know, compared to Valorant, where the only thing you're not choosing is your map. But it's okay. Okay, I should have warmed up a little bit more, but that's okay. For tonight, for League Play, I will be fully warmed up. I mean, I think I'm going to take like the first like 15 to 20 minutes of the stream just in a bot lobby, like warming up. Like, I, I will not allow this, what's happening right now, to happen to me during a League Play match. Now, a really good tip for league play, I want to tell you guys, you want to have at least one class. Each person should have at least one class. We should also need to have at least one person choosing the class, the engineer class. You want to have an engineer class. Here's the deal. In pros, they have three trophy systems, and that's GA to three. You can't have four trophy systems where we're not going to have any of those GAs. Like, no one's going to be respecting GAs. So there's going to be four trophy systems at a time. You don't want to run into four tro- Oh, hello. Hello. Oh, okay. Bad aim. That's okay. But you don't want to run into four trophy systems. So you're going to want to have at least one guy running trophy systems. Our engineer. All four of you should be running trophies. One guy running an engineer to take care of the enemy trophy systems. And then everyone else that's not running trophies needs to be just chucking stun grenades. Like, just chucking them left and right. Yeah, people are going to have tack mask. But if you can just chuck them left and right. And they, like, you can have your engineer guy breaking the, well, stun grenades and Simtex, because if you have your engineer guy breaking trophies, it's going to eventually go through. You know, if you have four Simtex on a, on the hill at once, you're going to eventually get someone. That was terrible aim. Now, hopefully, eventually, League Play does get fixed, and we're not around, allowed to run per grid. And that's another thing. If someone's running, you know, if they're running the overkill, like, then they can't run per grid. So then they probably won't, you know, they'll probably have Ninja and Gung Ho instead of Attack Mask and Flag Jacket. I saw that guy, but I didn't. Whatever. Um... So, some people might not even have tech. And also, you might be running into someone who has engineer, like like I plan on running for my team. Dude, everyone's sniping. Oh, that's not very nice of you guys to be sniping me, dude. But you definitely want to have that kind of a setup. It's just going to help you a ton. Especially, you know, if, if you're playing League Play in a stack of four, which is, you know, going to be the most optimal way of playing. Especially right now when all the leagues aren't even... Or all the rules aren't even correct anyway. I'm sorry that I just had to do that to you, but let's see. Were you running a sniper? Oh, no, you're running the FFAR. Okay. I'll say, if you're running a sniper, I really don't feel bad about it. I mean, if you're running a sniper, you deserve 
to get pistoled because you deserve to get one shot killed every once in a while like you do to me really bad aim but that's okay i died to a kill streak my least favorite way to go and i'm gonna have to get used to that a lot for tonight because everyone that's another thing like league play doesn't have kill streaks reset on death like it's so unfortunate really hopefully they fix league play soon now i said like so many times like i would rather play a broken league play than not play league play at all which is true however i was hoping to say that like I, what i meant when i said that is like give us a broken league play on the first week of the game not month like no don't make us wait four months for a league play and then give us a broken one like i figured you know i figured like the plan would be give us a broken league play at launch and then by now we would have the fixed league play but what, what are you gonna do you know so it is what it is we're just gonna keep on keeping on once again i'd rather have a broken league play than no league play at all however i do wish it was perfect since we waited so long it is what it is we just finally have league play i did a lot of complaining on twitter and i'm just gonna try my best to stop doing that but we'll see what actually happens but tonight regardless i'm gonna have a good time now that i've just accepted that everyone's gonna be running overkill once you just accept the crap and you just do it with you know you just do it with everyone then it is you know it becomes what it oh my goodness dude why is everyone sniping at least i don't have to deal with this anymore these like aim assist sniper boys you know this by the way that the m4 i'm running right now is the m4 class that we made at the beginning of the video like for league play so just so you guys can you know this is the exact same attachments i have the not the task force barrel on but the one that does like plus 100 bullet velocity this is that exact oh you know i don't want to go up in this building because Oh crap, I don't I want that to be spawned on the other side. Is there gonna be another guy here? Yeah, there is. They spawn right behind me. Oh, that's good though, because that means we got this spawn, which is exactly what we wanted. I don't have trophies on this class though. Because this is just like my like I was playing free for alls, which man, free for alls just get tougher and tougher every time I play them. I don't know how oh I got killed by an AUG. At least we that's another thing. We'll have to be dealing with AUGs anymore or M16s. That's gonna be awesome. I can't wait, honestly. I can't wait. Let's me sit on the hill, help out my team. Let me smoke this nerd never mind i can't smoke anyone because my you know it didn't warm up enough or at all uh, no i did warm up for like five minutes i need to warm up for like 20 i need to shoot like 100 bots oh man i feel bad for doing that too but also not really another thing that's really cool about league play is there won't be any stim shots i mean i have stim shots on because once again i feel like i have to and if league play you know i'm actually surprised that they banned the stim shots because i mean they didn't ban anything else that's supposed to be banned my aim sucks, guys. This is why I don't want to play free for alls anymore. I'd rather just play hard play work. At least I can sit to the hill and help my team take the lead back. But there won't be any M16s. There won't be any AUGs, shotguns, LMGs. Like, at the very least, they got, you know, that stuff out of the way. And then there won't be any stim shots, which is going to be really nice. So, we're going to, you know, as much as I complain, I am still grateful. Okay? I, I try my best to hold back my complaints. This is yesterday. I was, I was ultimately upset by the fact that we waited... I mean, months, literal months for league play. And when we finally got it, it was hot doo doo cheeks, in all honesty. Where's my stem? I need a stem. I don't know what to do. I don't have a Simtex for the sensor gun. Dang it, dude, he sniped me through the wall. We're back on the hill, just the way I like it. I like to be on the hill, helping the team out. Let's throw this pre nade here and then watch. I'm just going to come around the corner right there. He has aim assist sniper, though, so. GG to that guy for, you know, I shot him first and there's no flinching in this game. That is, you know, it is what it is. Oh, that's another thing, guys. When you play searches in League Play, be prepared for everyone to be running that smoke grenade, which is why I told you to run cold-blooded because since so many people are going to be running smokes because that's the only counter to snipers is a smoke grenade, uh, there's going to be a lot of people running thermal. Like, when I was watching the streams, I seen people running thermal sight, like thermal sight uh, M4s or whatever. That's why you want to run the cold blooded so you can do your absolute best let's just go ahead and stop the front line here you want to run cold blooded so you can do your best to not be seen by those thermal sites as much as possible i cannot believe i just used an artillery strike and then to get one single kill that actually kind of blows my mind how did they get in behind us you son of a gun so there's like five of you back there i got front we're gonna hold the line here here they come i hear them i hear them right around the corner we're just gonna to stay here i mean i i just want to hear for the win you know i'm sick and tired of losing in all these videos there's no way my teammates can't stop that one guy dude hello like team you iron man get out of here you out of here i know i'm using cheap i know i'm using the cheap magnums but you know what these guys are using the cheap aim assist sniper rifles so i don't feel bad about it dude beat me in league play tonight where i actually have time you know what i'm saying i wish i could like like i said i'm i'm glad that we can't choose our game modes because then people would only pick hardpoint or people would only pick search and straight no one would ever pick control but 
So I'm glad that like we can't pick our own game mode, but like in the case of these videos like man Sometimes I wish that I could it is what it is I'm just you know once again I'm just not gonna make league play videos my videos will just be pubs You're gonna have to come to my streams and watch some you know watch some of the watch some of the league play there Am I might I am about to die to that napalm strike Okay, we're still holding this front line down like we own this place. I I overextended oh like way too far right there. I'm gonna try to slide right under where the sniper guy's looking, and then we're gonna slide right into here with our flag jacket, stim shot, and here we go. I'm just gonna hold down the sign. Look at the mini map. We are in trouble. Let me just pull these out because I yeah he stunned me. You gotta pull out the magnums when you get stunned. I'm getting stunned out the wall. Oh no, another nade. They just lose a million grenades at me right there. It is what it is though. I mean look, we're we're waiting now by 40 seconds. This is good. Let me, oh, there was two of them. Dude, I was gonna say, let me like overextend here and try to smoke them. Going 41 31 on top of the leaderboard. Feels good to be on top. I haven't been on top in a long time. No man, I'm at the bottom of the leaderboard. And fruit. Dude, right there, bro. Like, why? <laughs> why is there no flinching on sniper rifles? Dude! I honestly feel bad for what I'm doing, but it's the only way to stop. It's the only way to stop the sniper boys from like attacking me. Dude, I suck right there. I deserve to die. That one, I deserve to die. But once again, why are there no? I got Okay, I'm gonna stop complaining. Let's stop complaining. Let's just win this game. We're gonna spawn in, throw a nade because you can't hurt your Oh, dude. One thing that's another thing. Better sweet about league play. I'm glad that there's team fire because there should be team fire. But that's gonna suck when you're playing solo. And you just have a troll on your team that's constantly killing everyone. And I don't think that there's a penalty. And I also don't think that there's a leave game penalty yet, which is, like, weird. Like, I feel like that is just a, like, standard, like, leaving a game when you're playing league play is like playing Call of Duty with guns. Like, the fact that you can't, like, the fact that there's no penalty for leaving the game, I'm like, I would be, like, I thought that would be more obvious than like putting guns in Call of Duty. Like it's such an obvious thing. But for what, I'm, what I've heard is that's not the case. I'm not 100% sure on that one. And also, by the time this video comes out, I'm not sure if they will have fixed that or not. That'd be kind of cool. Imagine if by the time this video comes out, they just fix everything. That'd be kind of crazy. I mean, they are Treyarch, you know, they are Call of Duty. They have the money, they have the people, they have the brains to do it. Oh boy, I don't know what I was thinking. I was getting shot from behind, from in front. I was on fire, we throw a nade on the hill. All right, we're gonna stay here in loser corner and we're just gonna smoke someone as they come through. Oh, maybe not. Okay, I don't have a quick enough reaction time for that. You tried to tomahawk me and I almost died to you, dude. That guy just came. Hold on, let me pick up your repelling tin and show you who's the bosses around here. Watch this. Three. Two. Oh my goodness, he came around the corner too fast. You, gone. You, gone. You, gone. I'm actually amazing. I'm actually, I'm a sniper boy. Put me in phase. Put me in phase right now. Just not a phase CDL skin, okay? I want the optic CDL skin. It gives you plus 10% skill. Everyone knows that, guys. Everyone knows that. Oh, oh, oh. By the way, dude, I'm on I'm on keyboard and mouse. I'm not on controller, okay? So I didn't even have aim assist for all those shots, dude. So go ahead, leave a comment down below that this says how amazing I am at sniping. No, I'm kidding. I am kidding. Don't do that. You get off the hill. You get off the hill. You, you're lucky. I only hit you with one of my pistols, dude. You're lucky, but we're gonna win right here right now. I'm on fire again, huh? Baby, there we go. That was the win. Just had to hold that line and we win too far. Oh my goodness, I'm on top of the leaderboard. Let's see here. What is the other team doing here? 71 kills, not enough. 71 kills, but only 16 seconds, buddy. 62 kills, only 36 seconds. I'm rocking 55 kills in 2 minute 30. I mean, I'm holding down the line. And look at this dude with his aim assist. This, like, double snipers, bro. I can't wait to not play against this anymore. Oh, I can't wait for tonight. That is going to do it for today's video. Hopefully, you guys enjoyed the League Play classes at the beginning. Once again, I really hope that League Play can get fixed. So then those classes are, you know, they become useless. But for now, those are going to be the best classes that you're going to want to rock. I mean, you know what I just realized? I didn't put any AK-47s in there because I just have a little bit more respect for myself. If you don't have any respect for yourself, just go ahead and replace all those assault rifle classes with the AK-47. The same attachments, I believe, and you should be good to go. But that is going to do it for today's video. Hope you guys enjoyed it. Please leave a like and subscribe if you're not already on your way out. We are super close to 700 still. Super, super close. Thank you guys for hanging out. I'll see you guys later. Goodbye.